With all of these rough landings, it may be hard to believe there were angels in the drop zone. Now these angels don't have halos or wings, but what they do have is extraordinary. Go! Yeah, my brother, he's here participating. So we came out, he's part of SOC uh, He's He's a jumper as well. So it just kind of worked out the time he was good where I was here doing this and uh, he could come out. So I got an exit with my older brother and that was for cinema value. That was probably the best part. Master Sergeant Kevin Angel, a paratrooper from Special Operations Command Korea, or SOC Corps, flew more than 5,000 miles to jump with his brother for the very first time. Having him do all my safety checks and everything, I, I had complete confidence. Uh, and watching him conduct the air operations from the aircraft and seeing how he was able to do it, it was spot on and he was doing his job as an absolute professional. What's special for me is uh, that I was able to uh, do this entire airborne op with him throughout the week and then today I was able to go out right in front of him, have him follow me out. Go! It was good, it was a good exit. Uh, I did well, he will watch the video and see how he, how, how, how he did, I guess. I got some serious twists. <laughs> We were also able to have our father out here watch us come down and walk in together. So it was a very special day for the entire family. One minute, they're bumping fists. The next minute, they despise each other. We gotta be talking like we're close. You gotta pretend like you like me. Like I like you. Yeah. The only logical explanation? They're brothers. Which one's thrown up more? My older brother has. I'm at zero though for what it's worth. <laughs> These brothers share a special friendship, one that only siblings would understand. Airman First Class Austin Siegel, Ramstein Air Base, Germany.